What's going on with all my money motivated stars? Now in this video, I want to get more in depth about creating your own reality and trying to really define it in a better way than I probably defined it before. So people can really understand, you know what I mean? Cause we coming into a whole thing of manifestation. I want to kind of stay on this topic. You know, I don't know how long I'm gonna stay on it, but I just want to stay on just like the life bettering path uh, for the moment. Probably just in this video. I may come up with another topic uh, in a couple of hours or tomorrow, you know. But understanding, creating your own reality. Because we got to realize on this planet, it's a lot of people who, what they say, living under a rock. You know what I mean? Just like that. Because I, I was one of those people. And I'm still kind of one of those people where I do more and... I'm trying to get back into my living under a rock phase. I was doing it way better when I was, you know, in my own space. But when you living under a rock or basically in your own reality, you know what I mean? Because there's a lot of people, we stand on, we all stay on, on this same planet, but we're living on different vibrations. So that causes us to live in different realities. You know what I mean? Some people are living on lower frequencies while they think about the sex. They all think about it's murder, to think about, you know what I mean, robbing, scheming, getting over on somebody. That's a low vibration. A lot of us not living in that reality. So the people who live in that, in that reality, they're always thinking people trying to get over on them based off their th internal thoughts. They always trying to get over on people, but they don't want people to get over on them. So they always thinking, they got to think a step ahead, be 10 steps ahead. So that's the reality they're living in. And you have those of us who transitioning from being in an environment that's thinking like that, you know what I mean? This a little step above, cause this not meaning you better than nobody. It's just meaning your thoughts elevate at a higher frequency than the people whose who frequency of thoughts are lower. You know what I mean? Cause some people who just think about peace and meditating and being in the garden all day. I'm not there yet. So, you know what I mean? My vibration is not where that person is it. You know what I mean? Some people are really just trying to ascend and just have nothing but peace. We'll get there one one day, you know what I mean? But as of right now, we creating our own reality and we're basically creating what we see. So a lot of people, when it comes to like world disasters, cause this is how you really get over world disasters and all this stuff that's in the matrix, you know what I mean? When you're not giving your energy to it, it's like it no exist. It don't exist. You know, I'm, I'm gonna give an example. Say if it's a a person who just got a job. It's a dude. He just went to work. You know what I mean. He just got a job. He was with his girlfriend like twenty four seven, taking her out to eat. You know what I mean. Doing things for, her, and he gets a job. You know what I mean. Any old job could be Walmart. You know, so he working at Walmart and he starts to talk to somebody else. You know what I mean at his job but when he starts to cheat on his girlfriend at the house he's doing it while he's at work while they on break or something you know what i mean so it's people going back to her telling her yo oh your dude is cheating on you your dude is cheating on you but if she doesn't believe that it's not gonna become you know what i mean it's not gonna shift her reality you know what i mean so one these people at work could be seeing something totally different in their reality but she's seeing something different, especially if he goes home around the same time and the routine that he does every day, it doesn't switch up, you know what I mean? So it leaves no question in her mind, like they cheat because he come home, he's still taking me out, he's still, you know what I'm saying, making love to me, he still purchases me items. That That's like two different realities in one world, you know what I mean? These people at the, his job looking at him like he ain't nothing, his girlfriend at home looking at him like he's the, you know what I'm saying, the man of the world, you know, because there's two different realities. She's thinking on one type of frequency, they're thinking on a different frequency, you know? And their frequency doesn't control her frequency because she's not buying into that, you know what I mean? Because if she was to buy into that energy, she can go up there and catch them on lunch break or she can go do that if she wanted to feed into their energy but since she's not residing on their frequency because they didn't place her there she cook she cool so when you watching the news and all that they're trying to place you on a certain type of frequency so when you feed into that and they say oh it was three murders committed a day around my neighborhood around your neighborhood we on the lookout if you really 
feed into that and look at that, it's gonna scope your whole, it's gonna change your whole reality. You know what I mean? You're gonna look at like everybody out here trying to get you and you're gonna bring, pull more of that to you. You know what I mean? So about scoping your reality, you have to not feeding the stuff like that, be in your own world and routines play a big part in if you wanna change your life. If you if you cool with everything, you know what I'm saying? Just keep your same routine, but routines play the biggest part in trying to have a prosperous life and manifesting because if you were doing the same thing as today as you did yesterday, and that's your mindset, and that's your so-called routine, nine times out of 10, you're gonna be doing the same thing next year. You're gonna be in the same spot. You know what I mean? It's just like walking up a flight of steps. You know what I mean? If it's 10 um, steps on here that you gotta take and you walk up five steps every day and walk back down them five steps, you're never gonna see the sixth step or the seventh step if you never took the time out to do that. Now, if you change your routine and the Thursday you walk up six steps, flight of steps, you're gonna see something above the horizon that you didn't see on a fight, the, the field flight of steps, you know what I mean? So it's all about routine. So if you don't change your routine, you're gonna still do the same thing. That's why people like Joe Dispenza, uh, uh, what is his name? Billy, Billy, Billy Carson. They tell you about frequency changing and changing your routine because if you change your routine, you're gonna see a lot of different stuff that you didn't see in the future. You know what I mean? That's how you, that's how you manifest and that's how you change your life because like I said, repeated action, brings you repeated results if you walk down the street every day even though this is totally made up if you walk down the street every day and you got a sack on you trying to sell some weed at the same corner store and this police officer pull you over every day and you get locked up you know what i mean i know this is this is imaginary you know what i'm saying so work with me i know you ain't gonna get out and keep on getting out unless you snitching you know what i'm saying but if you pull out that sack and serve this person at the store at the same time every day why this officer is here, you're going to go get locked up every day. So one day, one day you decide to walk down the street and you don't got none on you. You're just going to start to buy something. You're not going to get locked up that day. You know what I mean? I'm trying to make it as simple as possible. Just by changing your routines, stop doing stuff that you would normally do. That's not bringing you the results that you don't want, you know, or that you want. You know what I mean? So I got to see, I speak for myself when I'm saying all this stuff, changing your routine, man. Just try to implement one new thing a week that you don't do, you know what I'm saying? X out all the bad habits and implement more good habits because if you implement more good habits, your life is bound to change because you're doing something that you didn't do before the prior month or the prior week, you know what I mean? So it is what it is, man. So change your reality, make better routines, make better choices so you can just fit your own vibration and try to be in your own reality because a lot of this stuff, we don't have to see unless we just search search for it or if it comes to us we can ignore it or we can choose the will in that type of energy we can tap into that type of energy you know what i mean we all see the low vibrational videos that pop up on youtube but we don't have to click on those videos yeah it might see the title might seem enticing the, the thumbnail and all that but you can simply just go search up what you want to see or what you feel like would be beneficial to you you know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, man, y'all be blessed on walking this smoke.